I am getting ready to do a song that was requested by Sterling Ross. It's Jefferson Starship, Jane. Let's get on right to it. Here we go. Wrong now. This whole song was kicking butt. <laughs> I mean, from the beginning, how they start off. I love what a lot of songs do that where it's they they'll do what they did in here by starting off like it was like a slow tempo, and it just boom it hits you. So you already got the surprise going on in there. And by the time that surprise hits you, by the time the surprising feeling or sensation starts to wear off, then they do what they did like the last thirty seconds of this song. I mean, just started killing it on the drums and everything. They the 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 drums, the guitar, and all that. I think what happens in here a lot of times is that, like, most some of you guys out there know if you're a drummer or either any musician whatsoever, if that lead singer starts pumping it out 
Like what he started doing, it just makes you get that more into it. You just start going crazy, tearing the drums up like nobody's business, man. That's what I love about that. But um, other than that, man, Sterling Ross, this is a nice song. I did that, that, that uh, I don't know why in my mind, I start hearing that, uh, first of all, well, I don't know if it goes like this, but you know that, that, doom, that, here I am, marching like a something, something, da 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 da. That's what I thought about. I don't know if it has that same little cowbell in there. I don't know if it has that in there, but all I thought about was that, that here I am. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about, but y'all do. Like, that's another one of the songs I told you guys that when I just did, I heard that song before, but I can't tell you where. I just know I heard that chorus part a lot. So anyway, Stella Ross. Definitely dug this man. This is a kick butt song, just plain and simple. That guitar riff through the whole thing was just sweet, man. I'm pretty sure everybody know that. This would be one of those songs where if they didn't play the lyrics and they played that guitar riff in there, you guys would be like, oh, that's such and such, you know. So, anyway, I enjoyed this man. Like I said, it really started getting down the last 30 seconds of this song, man. Loved it. All right, Sterling, I know you changed this up, but um, this particular song, where were you at when you first heard it? When it struck you, can you even remember the feeling you had or what you thought in your mind whenever this song hit and you're like, oh my God, blankety blank, blank, blank. Fill the blanks in for me. Everybody else, you do the same thing. Tell me where you were, where you were standing, how the air smelled, what you possibly were eating when you heard this song right here or any of the songs I've done. I like to read those things. As you can see, I usually leave a heart by when you guys tell me that stuff. I love reading your history on that. It's memories, people. It's amazing how the brain can just bring up those things. Some of you told me that like things that you completely forgot about for like 15 to 20 years. I played a song in my reaction video and it just brought up all this stuff. And some of you guys told me you actually it made you remember something about your grandparents or something that you completely thought was erased from your mind. That's the reason why I love doing this and like hearing y'all stories because I like reading it. I'm Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man, hoping and praying that every last one of you guys have food, shelter, and clothing. And I hope and pray, most of all, that every last one of you guys are in great health. God bless you all in Jesus' name.